Let's give a round of applause for that, y'all. Yeah. Give him a round of applause. Check it. I get, a, I get a great opportunity of talking to Chris about a lot of things when he, he calls or he calls me and we just talk about things. And, and the one thing that I find is mad interesting is, is Chris's concept of, of, how, of how drummers should practice and how they should be ready as far as chart reading and, and just being uh, the best that you can be. So Chris, speak on that like we did a conversation we've had. Um, no, it's just like a lot of drummers, not to me, but a lot of my friends that play drums that some of them are here right now that are crazy on the drums, but, uh, they, um, you know, people just be like, well, how do you get faster, or how do you get around the set more quicker, or my left hand hurts when I play, or things of that nature, and it's like, um, it all just go back to rudiments, and, um, it's really, you can't really get around that. So, you know, it's always trying to find shortcuts or, you know, I could do these licks or whatever. But it still just goes back to like, you know, even the first 10 are hard, honestly. So, it, you know, it's kind of coming from that standpoint, like, you know, you could do all, of, you could do whatever you want once you know the rudiments and as far as chart reading and, and stuff like that, it just, um, it helps you if you want to like really make some money, you know, people going to call you and be like, yo, you know, okay, I heard you play with such and such. I really want to do some stuff with you. You know, let me give you these charts. We don't have time to rehearse and I give you this check. And then you looking up the music, you know, like, man, could you send me a tape? Like, uh, for something on my Xerox machine. So, you know, and a lot of times, you, you know, you know how we were cheating in high school, so you'd be like, in the big band thing, people be playing, you'd be like, just go and play it, and you try to fix your song with while the band be doing all the hits and stuff. And then you'd be like, oh, y'all want, oh, back from the top? Okay, cool, I got it. Then they go, all right, section C, and you'd be like, oh, uh, okay. Oh, oh, that part, oh, yeah, I, I know what you're talking my pages be tripping, you know, so. You know, it's just more on that. I was just talking about because it's a lot. It's a lot of gigs out there, but it just requires reading, and it don't necessarily mean it's something you want to do. But you know, if people complain about the checks and all that, it's there. You know, there's people working all the time, and they 
they fly you and do whatever. All you gotta do is read music. But a lot of cats be like, that's cool, but I'm gonna go play on this tour and make this loop, and then the tour be over. Then the artist be like, well, I'm gonna do a play or something. You know, I'm gonna do this movie with whoever, you know, Tom Cruise, or, you know. And then you at the crib. You know, your girl looking at you, man. You all like, yeah, I, I was supposed to go out last week. Oh, wow. <sighs> you know, that mortgage gonna hurt next week. You know, so, and it's all, it was kind of stemming from that, because a lot of people was like, well, how do you get faster? Or this and that. Or I saw, you know, a certain cat play, and his, you know, it seems like I never be able to get to that point or whatever. And it's like, it's just, you know, single strokes and doubles and, and basics, really. And it's like, you just start with that, which everybody hates. I mean, it sucks. I ain't gonna lie. Practicing sucks. But, you know, you gotta do it. And that was it for the dance part. That's it, cool. Give a round of applause for that, girl. That's bad information. All right, for this, um, damn, it's loud. Um, all right, I'm gonna bring up another, yeah, this one will be first. All right, bring up Marcus Strickland, which is like, that's one of my other favorites. Y'all fuck with it. Bring it back, uh, and y'all don't probably know Robert the Comedian, but he's really retarded, but he's acting, he's on his best behavior today. Wonder why. No, he, he did. He cool. Everything's cool. He was just cool. No, it's cool. He was good. He was good. <laughs> so we're going to bring up, um, actually, it's a tune. Tonight is called The Experiment. Yeah, so we're going to do this tune. It's called um, Mark It Up. And once again, Gary Thomas saying, Casey Benjamin. I guess this kind of is a. So yeah, we just play this for you know the time. So I just so I know y'all bored. Mm -hmm. 